at it again with another video. As y'all can tell, we are already out and about. The weather is like a little bit dreary today. It's like 75, so I have on this sweater and like a jumpsuit combination. Just left Starbucks. I got a venti iced pumpkin cream chai tea latte extra ice and like a single shot of espresso because your girl is like tired truly and then i also got some egg bites it actually tastes really good with the um shot of espresso i'm surprised because i really was just kind of like experimenting But yeah, I forgot to tell y'all, if this is your first time coming across my channel, definitely be sure to subscribe if you would like to. Make sure to interact with your girl down below in the comment section. Talk to me and I do talk back. As well as be sure to give your girl a thumbs up. But I'm about to head to Target because I finally was able to get my hands on that um, Issa Ray Perseco. So I'm about to go pick it up because I did a pickup order. And then I'm also about to go to Trader Joe's and um, Publix to do some grocery shopping. So I will check back in with y'all once I get to my destination because I'm about to try to eat and drive. So peace. <laughs> To make this process real quick, no looking around because the last time I came here to Target, the parking lot was crazy in the garage, and I'm trying to Maybe I don't. We got the goods, y'all. We got the goods, we got the goods. When I tell you, I literally was trying to make this an in and out transaction. It was real quick. So now I'm about to exit out of this parking lot <laughs> where I gotta pay $2 for only being here for like two minutes and go to Trader Joe's where I'm gonna get free parking. <laughs> so I shall see y'all at Trader Joe's. Maybe I don't be mine. Maybe I'm just fucked up. Maybe it's the love, the drugs, the weed, the pussy Maybe it's all the above Maybe I don't be mine Maybe I'm just fucked up Alright, so everybody and their mother was at Trader Joe's But we made it out in record timing My main reason for coming to Trader Joe's is because I wanted to make the Beria Pizza So I got all the ingredients for that, which I'm like really happy about. Um, I actually already have like a few ingredients at home. So we're gonna do that tonight for dinner, along with drinking our Issa Rae Persecco. But let me log onto this Zoom that my professor sent out because your girl's actually supposed to be in somebody's class. Yeah, I'm actually supposed to be in somebody's class right now. It's a slow paced class, so you could do like your reading by yourself. Um, and like take the test and stuff by yourself. <laughs> but I think I've only gotten through like a little bit of the chapter so far. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna check back in with y'all. Let me pay attention to the road. And um, I'm gonna see y'all once again. Hands on your knees, hands on your knees, hands on your knees. Shake that ass straight, now shake that ass for me. Like you pulled the phone, I'm gonna get you right. I'm not buy you ice, mama. Hope that puts the tight, mama. All right, y'all, so I'm back home. About to do a quick little grocery haul for y'all. So let's rush through this. Oh, I got a new cup from Starbucks. 
I haven't purchased a Starbucks cup in a little minute. But this cup is so cute. They had the taller version, but I just really thought like the smaller version was so cutesy. So I got that. From Publix, y'all know I always get a bag of ice. <laughs> Definitely need to get an ice maker. I did not know you bought a bag of ice. Yeah, I actually saw a bag of ice. <laughs> okay, so I guess we got two bags of ice because my mama purchased the bag. Just need to go ahead and invest in an ice maker, but we do not have the counterfeit. I got these crimp crimpinis, crepinis. These are like these egg wraps. They were buy one get one. I got some dull like smoothie blends. These were buy one get one as well. I got some yogurt just to get some more protein. This one is the Greek banana cream. This one is a lemon tart flavor, which low key, these were supposed to be, I would get one, but I don't understand why they rank up as like two for three. This is the Greek strawberry cheesecake. This is the Greek vanilla i feel like low-key public's just been scamming us with a um bogo deals another strawberry cheesecake and then another vanilla then i got these good pops these were buy one get one Loki just realized that I did not get any um true food, but honestly, I'm happy I didn't. What you say, Mom? If you return with Tarjay, um, if you use PayPal, did they um send it back to PayPal in the store or they store? I think so, yeah. Then I got these pineapples with um tangent. Me and this lady were talking about them in the store, and she was asking me how I ever tried the tangent on a pineapple but i was like no i definitely have tried it on the mango but i don't see you know where they could be any different then i got these palm um pomegranate peach passion white tea they were like two for three and then this one is pomegranate honey green tea and then i got some kabasa probably saying that wrong just butchering it <laughs> uh sausage then i got these honey sweet cashews and then i got this honey chipotle cashews and then i got these um protein bars it's like these keto protein bars these were buy one get one one is like milk chocolate coated with chocolate and then the other one is milk chocolate coated with uh peanut so we'll see how those taste and then i wanted to try the liquid iv because i always wanted to purchase these they're pretty pricey and i saw that they were buy one get one so i was like let me try them out one is watermelon and then the other one is lemon lime. So I just thought it would be a good time to try them while they're on sale. Let me put these groceries away and then I'm going to show y'all what I got from Trader Joe's. All right. Let me show y'all what I got from Trader Joe's. I got these Rambletons. Chicken thighs, 
two packs of those. I got some honey for tea. Eggs. Two packs of those. y'all earlier i don't remember but i'm gonna be making the um berry of pizza so i got some pizza crust oh this is my wine well not even wine per se i only got one bottle because i'm like i don't know how it tastes it's been some mixed reviews Cilantro, spinach, cucumbers, sardines. Don't knock it till you try it. I got some hummus and pita chips. Tomatoes. Some probiotic drinks. I get these all the time. Black beans. Chickpeas. Romaine lettuce. I got some carrot juice. I love this Trader Joe's carrot juice. Some mozzarella cheese for the pizza. I already have the red onions and then I bought two packs of the area. Shrimp. I got this orange, peach, and mango juice. Um, I felt this will probably be good for the Prosecco, just as a chaser. And then I got some coconut water. So when I'm making my smoothies. So yeah, I'm gonna put that stuff away and then I'm gonna catch you guys later when I make my pizza and just have a little chill night I'm drinking on my Prosecco. So talk to y'all later. It's me not realizing that I actually had one more bag of groceries. I don't even know how I missed that. So I got some olive oil spray. My little shots that I always get. Another probiotic drink that I always get. Cottage cheese. I used to not be a fan of cottage cheese, but I put these in my eggs and it just makes the eggs more fluffier. And you also get additional protein. I got some like little beef jerky type sticks. I got another can of chickpeas. Lemon, avocado, pomegranate, tuna, and black olives. I love olives like in my salad. So yeah. That's actually the end of all of my groceries, y'all. So I will talk to y'all later.
All right, y'all. So I'm just about to finally make the Berea Visa. I've been editing a video and then plus ensuring that I was doing my classwork that needed to be finished today by five. So right now, I don't know. This phone says 6.30, but my phone says 7.30. So yeah, it's 7.30, I guess. I got all my ingredients. Got the piece of crust. Got the beef berea some cilantro for topping mozzarella cheese onion and then some olive oil because you gotta coat both sides of the piece of crust so i just turned the um stove on so i'm gonna go ahead and get the barrier ones up first and then once I put this um, in the oven, I'm going to go take a shower. That way I can pour it up, pour it up. <laughs> and watch uh, the new episode of Sisters that just came out. Because I started it, but I need to finish watching it. Are you gonna be, say that you're gonna be, tell you what I did last night, I came home, say, around a quarter to three, still so high, hypnotized in a trance from this body, so buttery brown and tantalizing. y'all so i'm about to pour me up this prosecco i already took a slice of pizza so i can't wait to eat that like it smells really good and once again this is the Issa ray prosecco if i can get it open Okay. 
Okay, Issa, you real fancy girl. Y'all can't even see me. Y'all yeah, can't even fully see me. Ooh. Hold on, this is giving a week. Oh my gosh, I hope I have a stopper. I think I do. Okay, I'ma just pour a little bit of it. It did not click in my head that we was not dealing with a school bottle <laughs> of Prosecco, like. Oh, this is strong. It's not bad, but I'm personally not a big fan of Prosecco. Uh, Prosecco. <laughs> I am personally not a big fan of Prosecco. Um, I don't know. I just like things that are like a little bit more sweeter. It's okay. It's not bad though. It's pretty smooth. Like. It's not that, I guess you could say, bitter, if that makes sense. Do I know how to work this stopper? Girl, you know what? I think it's because I'm tired and I need to eat. I'm hungry. <laughs> So I'm about to just pour a little bit of this orange peach mango juice in there just for taste from um, Trader Joe's. I think this just cancels out the taste of the alcohol. Makes it a little bit more sweeter. If I had to drink it on its own, I wouldn't do that. Like, it's not horrible. Like, I don't want y'all to think it's horrible. Because it's not. It's just not my vibe. You know, you know how Keith Lee be saying, like, it's just my opinion. That is not my vibe, okay? <laughs> so I'm about to eat, look at TV real quick, and just call a night. I'm actually super tired. It's like 8.31 now, so I'm eating real late, but it is what it is. So I will check in with y'all, if not tomorrow, sometime this week, or just sometime in this vlog period, okay? Peace. Yes to stuff you ain't supposed to be saying yes to. So here's my big problem with a lot of y'all. It's your belief system is off. Like everybody can see how sweet you are. People are commenting on you could do this and you could do that. And you're the only one ain't caught up with it yet. Hey, what's up, you guys? 
guys. It's been a week <laughs> since I last talked to y'all, but I hope you're doing well. Today is a good Friday. Like, it's sunny. The weather is, like, very cool. It's not hot. I mean, it's, like, 81 degrees, but it's not, like, like steaming hot. Like, you know, it has, like, a little breeze to it. But I'm actually getting ready to head to my office so that I can go ahead and get a new computer because I just been needing a new work computer. I told y'all about that last week in my last vlog that I needed a new one. So we need to go ahead and knock that out of the way. The only thing that I'm kind of pissed off about is that they said the guy was going to be there at 12. But now all of a sudden they said that he was going to be there at 10. It's 1042, so... I probably could have got ready a little bit earlier and then just started heading down there because I really hate this drive to my office, especially when I don't have to go, you know, into work like every day. It's been like two years or more since I haven't been in the office. So yeah, you know, but I'm not gonna complain. I'm happy that I'm gonna get this new computer. I go get my nails done. My appointment is at 4, but Dina asked me if I could come at 3.30. So I hope that I could, um, you know, make it to her at that time frame. But I did let her know that I can't make no promises. So, yeah, I just wanted to check in with y'all. Hopefully, I get to run a few errands as well because there's some places that I want to stop. We did go to um, Publix as well as stay right there. Stay right there. Thank you. We did go to Publix and um, Walmart this morning to start like buying our Thanksgiving stuff. We're going to be doctoring up a lot of stuff, especially y'all saw in the montage I bought that stuff for mac and cheese. We're going to doctor that up because I seen on TikTok that somebody did that and they said it was real good. So we not cooking like a full blown large scale meal it's just really the two of us but i did you know just want to cook something to have some food that we could at least eat you know throughout the weekend so yeah just wanted to come say what's up and i'm gonna check back in with y'all just a little bit later let me go ahead and knock this stuff out the way and just pay attention to this road so let's talk about how i took that drive all the way to my office and when I got there, they said the IT guy had left. They didn't say he went on lunch. They said that he left. <laughs> like, I was so pissed off. I'm still so pissed off because in actuality, I was going to take the day off because I just wanted a little break from work. But they kept sending emails out back and forth talking about the new computers. And I'm like, I need a new computer. So I made it my prerogative to drive down there to try to get a new computer today and <laughs> he was like he gone like he left bon voyage <laughs> they didn't even care to see if other people were coming send an email say something like i'm not even gonna get on camera and complain because the lord knows my prayers for certain things but it's just like I can't. I can't, y'all. I truly, truly can't.
So I basically just left five and below. I had just finished getting my nails done before I cut them down. And I got this like deep chocolate brown color. I love it. Um, next month I'm getting a new set because I go on vacation. So this is perfectly fine. Hopefully the shorties last me for the next few weeks. So now I'm going to Ulta. I had to look at my coupon again because I just wanted to be sure that I could get some of the prestige brands because I really want to try to get the uh, Fenty skin tint, especially for a vacation, just to have like lighter makeup. So um, I knew I read it where it said that you could get the prestige brands. So, super excited. So yeah, I'm about to go there now, and then after that, I'm just about to get something. Hey y'all, happy Saturday. Wanted to stop by and just say what's up because I've been cleaning all this morning so i'm almost finished um i just need to put my last load of laundry in the washing machine and for the rest of the day i am about to just style outfits for my upcoming vacation because december will be here as soon as you know it and i just want to like go through my closet first before i order like any additional accessories or shoes or even clothes or anything else but i did want to show you guys what i wind up picking up yesterday while i was out running some errands and i also just want to show y'all what i got in the mail this week as well as a little wrap up of some of my new purchases so starting with five and below i really went to five and below so i can get um chargers and then i saw on tiktok that they did have like portable fans and I wanted to get some of those to put in the little like girl trip bag for you know everyone who's coming on a cruise well it's only my cousin and then my cousin's girlfriend who I'm doing it for just like the young ladies who are going on a cruise because everybody else is just like older <laughs> basically so um they didn't have them the guy said they didn't have anything in it, but I wound up picking up this like cloud cup this is how it looks and i just think it's so cute and then i got the chargers that's what i really needed the chargers then i got this cute phone case and I think this is so cute for like the matcha lovers. <laughs> so cute. And then I was so shocked when I saw this. Because I've been looking for this. I've been looking for like a full face like Hello Kitty mug. And at first I thought they didn't have them. But I bent that corner. And I seen them. And I was just like, yes. I'm getting that. I'm getting that. Oh, I actually went to the beauty supply store at first, but I didn't really pick up anything special from the beauty supply store. I saw that they had like my favorite lashes that I like to buy. So I got a pack of those. I also got some lash glue. This is one of my uh, favorite lash glues that I like to use. I got this beanie. Now, I ain't even gonna lie, the girl had pissed me off. Because this beanie was supposed to be $2.99. It rang up as $3.99. And I asked him, like, the beanie not $2.99? She's like, oh, they be putting the stickers on stuff wrong. Girl, you could have changed the price. Like, you could have changed the price because the owner is always changing the price for my stuff. Especially when they know they put stuff on there wrong. But I make a big deal. Got some more scrunch socks. I picked up this new color. So I got two packs of those. I already have black, but I just got another pack. Got another gray pack and then another white pack. Especially because when I buy stuff, I just like to stack up on it. Um, 
then I wind up going to Ulta. My goal in Ulta was only to spend a hundred dollars because I had a coupon. If you spend a hundred, you get twenty off. But that didn't happen. And then I also got an additional twenty percent off because they pre-approved me for the Ulta credit card, which I already had in the past. But it's like I stopped using it because I paid it off and I just never really used it again. So we got two bags from Ulta. Um, so this one just basically has like some of the goodies that I'm going to be adding to um, the little gift bags. So I got these Touchland hand sanitizers. So I got one for myself and then of course two for the girlies. Then I got these face masks. The girl was like, do you like these face masks? I was like, <laughs> I was like, I never tried them. Um, I'm just getting them for like a little gift bag type situation. So I got an eye mask for each of us because I felt like, you know, we may want to have a little eye mask session before we get rested up. And this one is, it says rested. It says, how do you look? It has retinol, vitamin C, and caffeine. And it says restorative hydrogel under eye patches for dark circles. So got that. And then I got two face masks. One is supposed to be like I'm peach, which says it's like vitalizing, you know, to vitalize the skin. And then the other one is I'm pearl, which is supposed to illuminate the skin. So I'm still going to go ahead and get the portable fans. I'm just going to order them online. And then closer to the time of the trip, I'm going to buy like snacks and stuff like that. So put inside their bags. Um, so yeah, I just thought it was a good time to use these um, coupons that I had. I'm just taking all of this stuff out of here. Then I wind up also getting these um, Elf Glow Reviver. Not Kiana. You know you can speak better than that. <laughs> These Elf Glow Reviver Lip Oils. It's an infused lip oil with apricot. So I just got clear for them because I didn't want to get, you know, anything like flavored or like with color because I just really don't know what people like when it comes to like makeup. But I did pick up the color red licious for myself and this color why do not my camera like my camera be failing me when I be trying to show y'all stuff like it just don't want me to be great okay this how I look let me open it up It looks like it's a deep red. It reminds me of a similar style gloss that I got from Glossier, which was like a deep red color. Then I got this one, which is in the color Honey Talks. And one thing about me, I don't care how many brown lip glosses, brown lipsticks I buy. Like, I love a good brown. And then this is how. That looks. Then I picked up this one that's called 
coral fixation. This is how it looks. This basically is just like a pinky clear vibe. Then I picked up the Black Girl Sunscreen Make It Pop. This is the Sun Gloss um, Sunscreen. And I've purchased this before. It's just like a clear gloss. And the reason why I bought it again is because this was sold out for a while. And since they was stocked up, I was like, let me buy it while I see it. Just a regular clear gloss. Then I got the Black Girl sunscreens. I got the spray. And then I also just got the regular lotion style so I'm gonna pack those for the trip I picked up this Pacifica crystal bronze shimmering body oil and baby I'm trying to be glowy we going to the Caribbean I'm trying to be glowy and I just kind of picked this up on a whim because I feel like a few of the body um, shimmers that I picked up haven't really gave me that effect that I really been wanting. So hopefully that works out. I picked up the Nemot. Hopefully I'm saying that correctly. Egyptian musk uh, fragrance oil. Mm -mm. Okay, I like this. I kind of picked it up on a whim without sm smelling it, but I know a lot of people have kind of raved about it on TikTok, especially when the uh, fragrance oils kind of became very popular. I picked up the Fenty Ease Drop Blurring Skin Tint. I felt this would be good for vacation makeup wise. This is how the packaging looks. So I could have like just lighter makeup. This will be my first time using it. I was kind of stuck between number 19 and 20. But I just wound up going with 20. I felt it blends it a little bit better. It was a little bit more deep. This is how the bottle look. And thankfully they had the 20 because they only had 19. So if I had to get the 19, I would have. But thankfully I asked and they wound up having the 20. And then I just got this L'Oreal Infallible uh, Precision Felt Liner. I just use these when I do my makeup to like bring the most back on my face. I think they must have changed the style of that because the one that I've been using and have been using for a while has like a little ball. So it makes it so much easier to like just really like make the circles in precision. But they didn't have it. So I'm assuming that it may be discontinued. Then I just also picked up the NYX Micro Brow Pencil in the color Espresso. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Can I open this? Probably not. Mm -mm. I mean, y'all, y'all know what a <laughs> what a brow pencil look like, but just in case. And I've been using this for years. It's like my holy trinity when I do my makeup along with the Anastasia. That's one thing about me. Like, I don't veer away when it comes to my makeup. 
<laughs> Especially if I like certain stuff. So yeah, that's all that I like purchased yesterday. And then let me put I can put this away. I can put this away, this one to the side, one to the side. Move that to the side and then we can just put these away. The amount of lip gloss that I have is ridiculous, but my smile and like my lips are one of my like favorite features on my body. So <laughs> I just always love like juicy lips. So let me show you guys what I've been getting in the mail these past few weeks. Um Starting first with these shoes, I've already kind of threw out the box and packed these away, but I got these Nike VBK, VPK, Nike VPK runners. <laughs> and I think these are so fly. Um, when me and Sida went to Kip, we also went inside the Kip store. We just didn't go to Kip Treats, but I didn't record in there. Um, we were looking at shoes and I saw those and I like, took a picture of them. Honestly, when I went in kids, I was very surprised at how like at the the regular retail price the shoes were. For some reason, I was expecting a lot of their items to be like resale value, but they weren't. Um, I also got these bags from AliExpress. Ladies, if y'all been looking for like the Bottega Dude style bags um, that everybody has been getting from Amazon, Go ahead over to AliExpress. I will link these down below for y'all so y'all can find them a little cheaper. This is the smaller version. Um, because Amazon is really upselling. <laughs> and if I can find stuff cheaper, I like to look on AliExpress or even Shein. This is the black one, which is a bigger version. And then I also got this red one. I saw this on Chrissy B. Styles is her name, if I'm not mistaken. And I just love this red one. So I will link that down below for y'all. Y'all can find them much cheaper on AliExpress as opposed to um, Amazon. What else? Last but not least, I got a bunch of jewelry because I decided that I wanted to do like an arm candy stack. So let me show y'all. I still want to find like a good watch because I just more so wear like my Apple watch and I do have like the various um, bands and I change them, but I want to find like a really good watch. So first I got this silver chain. It's like a silver flat chain reminds me of like a herringbone style chain. Yo, my camera, <laughs> we got to do better. Okay, we're getting somewhere. It's like a flat herringbone style um, bracelet. I really like that. And then... I got this other one, which is like a rope style. And then I got these Rolex style bracelets which I got one in silver and then I got one in um, just all gold. So this is the all gold one.
Yeah. This is crazy. But I'm not down here. Why are you focusing down there instead of focusing right here? <laughs> um, we're resolving this. All right, y'all. Let's try this again. Let, let, let's try this again. Yo, my camera is showing out. Uh-uh. This camera don't want me to be great. Finally, finally. Okay, so this is the all gold one. And then this is the silver and gold. I'm not a silver person like that. I'm trying to be a silver person. Um, but I like how this has a little bit of gold in it because I will always be a gold girl. And then the gold Rolex style bracelet also came with this cuff bracelet and then I wind up buying I'm gonna like stack them and show you guys like the vision that I was going for um but I wind up buying these like two faux like diamond tennis bracelets one is all silver and then like one is gold y'all yeah. So icy. So yeah, that's all that I got um in the mail this week and all that I picked up. I'm gonna go ahead and like try on these stacks so y'all could get a better picture of like what I was going for. Okay, so this is an example of a stack that I probably would do. Which I just think this is so fly. I got the faux Van Cleef from TJ Maxx. The Roly Van. The Cuff. And then like the faux. Um, diamond Tennis. Bracelet. Yeah, it feels icy. And then if I just wanted to do like take everything off maybe. Let me see how it looks with everything off. With just like two things. Or actually, let me take the cuff. Because I feel like this cuff is choking me. I had to call in some reinforcements to get that cuff off. The thing is, on a normal day, I probably would be able to get it off. But I just got my nails done. So that just makes it harder. So yeah, this is just how the tennis bracelet looks. And then like the Rolex bracelet just icy and then if I just wanted to stack it with the Van Cleef dupe y'all see the iciness mm, icy let me show y'all just quickly how the silver looks against the skin I'm, I'm not about to buckle not buckle but I'm not about to um put these on all the way because the time I just had I can't okay this is how these look like oh real icy and you see the K real icy okay it's definitely get my icy on the budget and then let's say i wanted to add one of my little thin pleat dupes oh that's nice Let's say I wanted to add the Van Cleef dupe on there. 
<laughs> sickening. So yeah, I got those. I love <laughs> what Drake said. Thomas, 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 on me dancing. All right, y'all. So I'm about to put this stuff away. I'm about to grab something to eat real quick, and then we're gonna eat some styling. So I'll hop back on camera then. Hey, you guys. Happy Monday, y'all. I abandoned this vlog. <laughs> Saturday and Sunday, I abandoned this vlog. I know on Saturday I told y'all I was gonna come back and do some styling for some vacation outfits. That did not happen. I ate and I went to sleep and I just laid in the bed all day. And then Sunday I woke up, did some schoolwork and just really laid in the bed all day. Like PMS really got to me and I was just so tired. Like I didn't feel like trying on any clothes or styling anything. So yeah, I just wanted to come and just close this vlog out and say if this is your first time coming across my channel be sure to subscribe if you would like to make sure to interact with your girl down below in the comment section talk to me and i do talk back as well as be sure to give your girl a thumbs up we're gonna go ahead and end off this vlog and i'm gonna catch y'all in the next video peace out